You're listening to WRFB Radio Free Britannia. In no other better freaking place in the world than Deltona, Florida. Here you are, lunch with no other than the dynamic duo, Laz and Jack. And greetings, everybody. This is Laz. And Jack's not going to be joining us today. He's out doing a barn raising. And we this are joined Jack. today by... We got Scrota. And Casey just left. And Casey just lost connection again. Well, anyway, there's uh, been an interesting uh, couple days around here, of course. Is that Casey making us reconnect here? Hey. Are you back with us now, Casey? Yeah, he'll catch up with us in a minute here. But, uh, Scrota, do you actually have the video right there? Um, I, I know it's right in, t in uh, Discord here. So, if you want to load it up so you can watch along. And, uh, what we're going to do is, uh, since Jack's not here, and we just released this uh, finally yesterday. I was talking about it on yesterday's show. Uh, we're going to go ahead and uh, roll the one-year um, retrospective as it is. The year-in-review tape. A uh, little history of NBNN. Uh, along with some, you know, giggles and grins. And again, damn, this radio is killing me. The radio is killing me. So we will catch up with that in just a minute. I have it up. Is uh, Casey, where are you at? You listening? You with us? I don't know where Casey is. I know. I see him at. trying to talk, so I can hear. I, I think he can hear us. So, Casey's in uh, chat. I can see him there. So he's connected that way. Now let me just uh, fix the radio here so the folks can hear us uh, as we as we chat about this and we play this. Say hello there to Ibeal Luther. He's just stopping by here in the studio. All right, so we are back on the air. Sorry about that, folks. I don't know what happened there. Uh, for those of you joining us on the radio, for everybody out there, for the record, today is March 18, 2016. Yesterday was our one-year anniversary here, stream streaming in Shrouded Avatar. Happy birthday. Yay. Yay, us. Yay. Yay. And uh, as anybody who follows our show and watches on a regular basis, uh, Knows we do some crazy things around here, um, and I was having all sorts of crazy problems in the machines yesterday, uh, just the way it goes sometimes. But uh, I was trying to get out this uh, compilation video, and was having the damnedest time getting it rendered. Uh, so it's out there for everybody to uh, see at their leisure, uh, to go back and look at it, laugh at some of the things that we've done, um, as well as. Uh, you know, for people on the radio who are listening and may be curious and, of course, can't see it right now, um, since they're listening on the radio, um, go back uh, to our YouTube channel, NBNN. Uh, look for NBNN News on YouTube, and you'll be able to check this video out. It's about 50 minutes long. So what we're going to do is uh, we're going to go ahead and roll the video, and we're going to chat about the video and commentary uh, you know, while the video is rolling. I'm just waiting for Casey to get himself queued up. If I'm here. here. I'm Alrighty, here. cool. Um, nice. So what I was telling Scrota, he's got the video queued. I've got it queued to play. If you would queue it on your side, and uh, this way we'll all we'll hit play right around the same time, and we can uh, chat about it as uh, you know as we go along. As it happens. As it as it goes. That's right. A Kush lady, how you doing today? Thanks for joining us. Want to say hello and thank you to everybody out there. Um, I hope you enjoy this. What we're going to show you here today. Uh, I wish Jack could be here for the commentary, but we'll catch up on that uh, 
on Monday. And, uh, of course, we'll have all sorts of other fun stuff and try and get back into the groove for the regular show on Monday. But uh, in celebration of our one-year anniversary, I'm going to switch this on over here. And put it up on the big screen. And what I'm also going to do is I'm going to move myself a little bit and uh, remove the overlay so that you can see... Uh, see the text on the bottom because you won't be able to catch that um, with the overlay on top there so our overlay is going to be gone alrighty guys bye, bye. So are we ready to do this got it up ready. and ready past the commercial and everything so. <laughs> alrighty okay folks stay tuned we're going to comment on what's going on here so kick back relax and uh, for those of you watching on stream i hope you enjoy it for those of you catching it later uh, again we hope you enjoy it all right guys let's go ahead and hit play on this bad boy Me. contains lots of adult language yes <laughs> And yes, it started I with the chair. In the dream. Yeah. yeah, they laughed. They laughed when I said that. This is Tracy Hickman, lead story designer for Shroud of the Avatar. If and you build it, they will come. NBNN. And we start. Tracy Hickman, one of the interviews we got during the time. I for a designer for Shroud of the Avatar. <laughs> this. Yeah, over the past year, you've had quite a few well-known interviews. Yes, uh, we'll get to that um, as uh, we get to that part here. But this here is one of the very first videos uh, ever recorded. Um, and again, we used to play, I used to play music and, you know, we'd get a groove going, go dungeon crawling. Um, and as I point out there in the video, um, hopefully everybody will notice the differences uh, in the videos um, over time. Um, not just ours, but uh, the ones from, you know, the video inside Shroud of the Avatar. Um, now, I got to let everybody know that the music that's in this is from this video and I enjoyed it so much when I did this video that what I did was I just looped it continually because it was a bitch syncing this up with just the music and trying to put it in so I had to position this with the music um, in the beginning which of course only makes sense so. This is Amber Rain of Avatar's Radio, and you're watching NBNN News, my favorite news station. There's Don't Amber. be a dick. Tune in and watch. The D oh, no, bad she's movie. Doing. Hashtag D bad. Don't be a dick. Um, that's right. Huh? Playing Shroud and the Avatar. Please, please don't be a dick to your friends and neighbors. You know, if you got to be a dick, you know, try and keep it to a minimum. But just yes, me and my dress. Yeah. Now, Scroda is actually here in this very first video here. Um, this is the crafting fair back in the day. Um, before I knew you. Yeah, before we actually even knew Scrota, um, he came across this, and one of the same things that we were talking about right before we came on the air was, this is one of the first video, well, first videos, but first times I've encountered Lord British, and I was just like, wow, you know. Damn, Lord British is actually playing the game, man. I'm digging this. Uh, and they had just introduced uh, Maker's Marks and uh, different materials for the weaponry and all this good stuff. Um, and we held a crafting fair, the Britannian Mining Company. And one of our members, uh, who's also a DJ on Avatar's radio, Drake Atis, um, walked Lord British, he had never played with the system himself, um, through making a sword, and he created this sword. And here we're going to come up, uh, and we're going to have an audio clip coming up, so when these audio clips come up, we'll try and let them play, um, where Lord British actually tells the story. And it's coming up right here, 
And this is where I really, this is where the bug came. Was running around with Lord British, Dark Star. The post-mortem was happening. This is we're Duke Violation, game. and you are tuned in to NBNN News. And here's another one, Duke Violation. But let this, uh, let's let the, let this clip play here. Oh, he's here. Okay, great. So Ezekiel, what's interesting is uh, the Britannia Mining Company uh, just a couple of days ago ran a big event and it was a crafting fair uh, where they had <laughs> invited numbers of members of their guild to become experts in crafting in different areas. Uh, they built out a big crafting area uh, where they had the crafting table. And you'll notice my window skills. capture really uh, sucked back on then. acquiring all the resources of all the different types. And they invited people to come there weren't and using and OBS and didn't and have the right be, technology you know, to get rid of that of, of, uh, <laughs> learning is fun to build final materials and this is the build this last build was the first time uh, that uh, final crafted items had takes time though yes them. yes and so uh, uh, and, and by the way we put new recipes all the time another thing that came in this time was the use of all the different metals and things the materials to make weapons so combination of truly unique individual weapons and I just the I all should be over here today release. and so uh, I had uh, one of their uh, crafters uh, walk me through the process of crafting an enchanted sword which I had honestly never done previously uh, so I didn't know how to do it it was not in my recipe book uh, they talked me through it I followed their instructions by following their instructions not only did I manage to then make that unique item that recipe that was permanently now part of my recipe book so I had learned how to do it by being taught it in real time and by chance that also be the first sword ever in Britannia old Britannia or new Britannia that has a Lord British maker's mark on it and so I gave it to Ezekiel who is head of the Britannia mining company uh, and there's the ass then if that's the uh, first so he explains there what happened with it Will there be any and here players? they explain what they're going to do on well, final we, white that has been the discussion on the website since that we've been getting all kinds of people emailing us and posting to try to find a way to at least let that item survive the wipe. There will be more wipes. And we actually don't think we have a way to preserve anything to wipe. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, uh, Scrota was typing back there, telling Lord British to equip the sword. Um, but there was actually a bug also, where sometimes you wouldn't see the sword. But yeah, I'd would, realize that afterwards. But after he, actually, he actually did not take the sword out, is what happened. <laughs> You're absolutely right. <laughs> Uh, I see. Bug. Bug. But, uh, we leave the maker's marks on them, so the, uh... So, now I had to position myself here in today's stream, because I realized that I'm going to appear in clips as we go here, and, uh, you would see me covering me, and it wouldn't make a lot of sense, so. So, of course, here... Yeah, well, he explains what they're going to do with the final wipe, which they've told us several times. Um, all this stuff that we're making in the world now um, is going to uh, hopefully be saved. Abidos has now gotten to the Crossroads Village level on his player own town. Congratulations. Keep up the great work. This is Dark Star. Congratulations. And I would tell you to listen to NBNN, but that wouldn't be very chaotic now, would it? No, that wouldn't be chaotic. Hello. Welcome. Now, this is funny. This, this is Cynicist. Classic. In game, I am Jack Frost and a few other characters. I have no idea who I'm going to be and when I'm going to be them. But this is NBNN's inaugural phrase that pays weekend. Greetings, everybody. This is Laz with NBNN News here to tell you and about again, the phrase This is that just pays playing weekend bad. <laughs> this weekend with release 18 of Shrouded Avatar. NBNN is giving away $100 in gift coins <laughs> for Shroud of the Avatar. This place is starting to freak me out! Caller's caller yeah. 9. Fun and stuff. And this is the... caller number like 9. And M60 for oh Jesus. Number nine this time? Is this M60? M60, you're caller number oh. 9. Do you have the phrase that pays? And this is um, the first time somebody... Oh shit. Oh shit, yeah. Um, uh, Shroud of the Avatar making magic happen, right? And we have a winner. Yes, we do. What is the phrase? 
Strategy Avatar yeah, making the magic me, happen. You are caller number nine. Who do when we I have? called in, it was I love this shit. That's what this one is. Ellie Beans, caller number nine, Yippee. with the phrase that pays. What is the phrase that pays? NBNN says we are all jack. NBNN says we are all jack. One more time to you today. Alrighty, who we got? You're live on the air with NBNN. This is Bambino. Bambino, do you have the phrase that pays? The inventor of Gus Ball. Now the outro are making the magic happen. And we have a winner. Hello there, I am Winfield. The I love that, people Paxler. calling in. I am on NBNN. Yeah, you know, greatest it's, network uh, we'll talk about Britannia. that. Dragon speed to you all. Now, Winfield was another interview. Now, this is one of my, this is my all-time favorite. The Monty Python Killer Rabbit Quest. Being in, uh, Winfield is actually a real good, real life friend of mine. Hello, Winfield. And this rabbit, if you watch the video, you watch my health. I had like four healers. My health drops almost to nothing twice. Um, this thing was a bitch. And of course, who doesn't like the little, little sing-along? <laughs> Oddly enough, I don't know the words to that. I'll have to Google the lyrics. Here we Sing go. it. I wish it Here was an Oscar Mayer Wiener. <laughs> That's what I truly want to be. As if I was an Oscar Mayer Wiener. Everyone be in love, love with me. me. There we go. Well, that was random. <laughs> <laughs> I think the only Oscar Mayer thing that I eat is their bologna. Oh, well, then we have the bologna song. Yep. Now, I believe uh, this was done. I, I, I gotta look at the date. My baloney has, has a first name. name. It's O S C A R. <laughs> he has a second name. It's M A Y E R. Oh, I'd love to eat it every day. And if I yeah. could, this is what I'd say. Because Oscar Mayer has a way with B O L A G N A. There you go. <laughs> now, if I look at the date here. Excellent job there, Lolly. That was fantastic. <laughs> it really was. Yeah, Jack. <laughs> I hope he sings some more songs. I missed out on uh, a lot of the song singing. Now what's this? My stream going, so... Hold on. Um, oh, I wish it was Lester Meyer Wiener. You mean that kind of song? That was the <laughs> Now, that's actually a reference <laughs> exactly. to us singing uh, earlier oh, in that uh, other broadcast. Uh, people were singing the Oscar Meyer Wiener song all day, this apparently. This is Chris Pierce, and you're watching NBNN. It's catchy. It's a secret video. Shh. Neon we can't, we can't talk about it. A rare <laughs> clip. Yes, yes, it is the secret video of you playing Lord British. I was playing Lord <laughs> British. Testing now, this is back Pax when Paxlayer was just coming in. Yes, he I don't was. know if I can ever let that out of the vault. I believe you can because you didn't use the suicide command. Dude, that would have been the ever most epic way to, to kill Lord British. Well, <laughs> he was playing Lord there, British so, and he had a yeah, chance to suicide him and he didn't. That yeah. unplug icon. That's why I have everybody this sitting. This is now if we the now famous uh, people at once. death of Lord British uh, inside of Shrouded Avatar. Lower my attributes one more time here, standing in the corner. <laughs> everybody, stop moving. You know, you have to have fewer zeros at the end when you lower them. I was Technically speaking, weird. when you add zeros to the end of the number, it's a bigger number. Yeah, I mean, uh, the whole know, world was there. Uh, okay, I'm just making sure. Uh, he had, uh, well, like, you know, 30 people shooting and whacking on him. I, I can't out heal this. <laughs> now, it's my understanding Man, that murdered. there were, uh... Lord British oh, no. has died. <laughs> Enjoy the light show. Several different views of this, and other people see, saw him die in different places. Uh, well, that's not what I see. Lord Bugs. The confusion. I cannot tell. Lag. Uh, I, I still see. Uh oh, I'm gonna fall though. Uh oh. Lags and fall. bugs. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Now you see him in I'm here going saying, I'm going down, and he'd already died like on my screen. Oh, okay, I'm going down. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> so what's gonna happen? Uh -oh. What is gonna happen? Oh, I have died. Oh, oh that man. moment. That you can moment. scroll that back. <laughs> I, I died. Now let me look back. Now this is the live stream. That that bad? <laughs> uh, everybody needs to get a screenshot of that one. Right, the is guys. the player interacting on, uh, here telethon the last time we had players put a telethon? Yeah, yeah the first first telethon got really wild because it was 12 hours. 
And it was hosted by streamers. I had one hour, Jack had one hour, several other streamers had other hours. And the developers were on, as you see, you know. So we were with them and doing our own stream at the same time. It was hysterical. So, um... The second telethon was also at a historical event, the, the first and only player uh, throw so party at Port Hilarium by some sort of case of cupcakes. Guy. Some guy, yeah, yeah, I know. And, uh, During the I need you to stream. get me an email to send it to. However you want to work that out, somebody that's watching your Twitch stream, I'll be giving that Founder Era Adventure to right now. All right, uh, Mandy. And yes. Love this, uh, love this announcement. Uh, be, uh, Listen to Lord uh, British here, uh, who he was killed by. R.I.P. Hey, by, uh, by the way, I say uh, Lord British was slain by uh, Wiz Kid Iron Scrotum. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to have kid. to, I believe. Wiz Kid Iron, Iron Scrotum. scrotum. Yeah. Uh, I love it. Yeah. Uh, there may be a variety of them. Now. He he got away with that. This is, this is funny. Reported shortly thereafter. The Gus Ball. Look, look at how bad these Gus Ball videos are. Oh, that's not cool. Jack and I sit here and bring you commentary as we watch the action happen today. And we are live with Gus Ball. So dry. The shroud is running out of here. Look at the different fields and the layouts over time. Yeah, that's neat. And the creativity of the player base out here has been phenomenal. Yeah, to see the different des designs and layouts and uh, textures. You know, there was grass, there was wood, there's cobblestone. Um, and yes, did I mention live? <laughs> versus the mutts play gust ball and we're live here that's the on only way to do it in, where we're bringing you gust ball here in release 20 and we are here today live with gust ball and here we go nbnn field gust ball Ashmal built that by hand Now this was during one of the parties and I was just sitting there and I was watching Lord British dance and I figured okay I got up and walked away actually. Um, I went to get a you know Pepsi or have a smoke something like that and I come sit back down and this is what's happening on my screen. Um, you'll, you'll see me try to adjust the camera at the end of this clip here but I actually caught the whole fight which is pretty cool. Um, Lord British looks like he's whacking somebody oh, yeah. with his flamey sword. He's, you know, somebody attacked Lord British while he's at a party uh, dancing. I just arbitrarily was, you know, on him. Of course, you know, Lord British was at a party, man. You know, I had to, had to stream this. You know, I had the bug. <laughs> and, uh, you know, I, I refocus on him and he goes, pardon me. Like nothing happened. You know, clean up an aisle five. Nice Greetings. This is Lord effect. British, and you are watching in the. Besides NBN. hoping to bake cupcakes, I'm hoping to collect dev skulls after the wipe. Now Greetings, this. Folks. Look how bad this is. As uh, you can actually hear me typing on the keyboard with the open mic, and yeah, no video. We we did. Finally got you to figure out the open mic thing. This is the very first interview we did with Amber Rain. Uh, way back in the day. Uh, this was uh, March 31st, 2015. Uh, and we got Amber Rain to come on. Um, and Amber, um, she, I know she's still laid up. She's recovering. Uh, I'm glad to hear everything's okay so far. Uh, we got you in our thoughts and prayers. I was going to ask. I tried texting her the other day. Never got a reply. But I sent her her shot glass. Oh, we're doing good. We've had a little technical Technical difficulties. Uh, we don't know anything about that around here, do we? This was the Winfield and, uh, interview. Get some and about he's holding the welcome torch there. there. See how bad that graphic is? 
Uh, hello there, Winfield. How are you doing today? Lazarus, good to be here. Welcome to Veilmark. You can definitely tell how the game quality has progressed. Absolutely, you know. NBNN and we're here live. And you know, I'm I'm happy we were there to document all this. How you doing today? Yeah. Really good, Laz. How are you? Duke violation. Greetings, everybody. This is Laz with NBNN, and we are live here on NBNN with Chris Spears. He's holding a uh, pot. Chris, cooking pot. I am doing great. And we got most of these guys to come in, into the game and actually do the, the interviews while we were in the game, which made it that much better. You know. Hell yeah. I'm doing great. Thanks for having me. Greetings, everybody. This is Laz with NBN. This is funny. And we are here today the Duke. introducing Duke Ezekiel Cooper to the world. Now, I assumed Duke, originally that he looked, looked close to his character, but when he showed me the first picture, I laughed my ass Come off. I said, we got to show this to the world. What's going on, guy? How are you there today, Duke? Thanks for joining us. Good, all right. You can go ahead and just wave hello to everybody there on camera. Say hello. And, of course, we have a special all guest right. joining us today. We have uh, sitting with us in the wings is Xavier Dark. Uh, Sorry, yeah, Xavier Starfall, <laughs> also with the BMC. But uh, our focus today is going to be here on the Duke. Now, of course, first off, everybody out there, everybody's probably going, holy shit, he looks like the Duke I see in-game. And, of course, uh, that is one of the actual surprises uh, of the world. Uh, I'm not the only one who wears a hat. And greetings, everybody. And then the Lord this British interviews with NBNN, and we are here live. And he went and put that jacket Richard on. That jacket he was just made for him, British. just for the well, not for the interview, but NBNN. he went and put it on. He says, "I just had this made. Let me put this on for the show." Uh, very excited to be with you uh, both live on NBNN and uh, looks uh, neat. Those live in the game, uh, wonderful. It's his Lord British jacket uh, here in person as well. And we are here live with Tracy Hickman. New York Times best-selling author, uh, lead story developer for Shroud and the Avatar, and author of uh, Blade of the Avatar. Welcome, Tracy. Lord British is actually uh, another one of the devs lucky enough to have. Oh, no, it's great being classes. with you today. Thank you for having us here. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. As with NBNN, and we're here tonight with Jaron Schwartz. Jaron's funny. Schwartz Har <laughs> of the Britannian Mining Company. Sharon, say hello to everybody out there. Hello, everybody out there. Yeah, everybody's a comedian. So. And then, of course, the most recent interview, and we go into... Uh, okay. You got to see Alrighty, how this... Folks. Welcome to NBNN. This is a live broadcast here. Special broadcast. We have Star Long, a.k.a. Dark Store from Port... Dark now, Star I'm part of the history. I am here. You've been there all along. And we just didn't know it. Uh, we are now in the <laughs> first video. You're in the yeah, last video. Here you are today. True. We are streaming on YouTube. We are streaming on Twitch. We are streaming as incognito. on incognito. And the wandering bard who is just unknown then. Trying to make a name for himself. Well, look where you've come. <laughs> um, all sorts of other things that uh, become controversial out there. Um, and of course, I want to say welcome, Star. How you doing today? Uh, I've I've been better. I'm a I'm uh, a little warning. Hungover. Strong adult Last language coming. I'm a lot hungover. <laughs> uh, those of you who uh, saw the hangout yesterday, uh, we were silly enough to volunteer to do a shot for every hundred dollars. Now, in this. Go yeah. to the next clip. Who came look up at the look at Star's number, face in the other uh, I video. I thought you guys were a little smarter than a hundred dollars. <laughs> well, I said five hundred dollars, and then Dallas said. Uh, you know, oh well, you know that that's probably too high. We probably, you know, that would be they're only going to be on air for 90 minutes, so you know, like do two shots. And I was like, oh, okay, well, well, should we do something like $50? It's like, oh no, 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 that's that that'll be too much. So like, so then we said on like $100. Surely, you know, and uh, and other and like on a typical day. 
that wouldn't that would have been you know a hundred dollars <laughs> in yeah, ninety typical minutes. Day. Like, you know, would have been very Jack was responsible. For okay, you need to do row. the last one. No, 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 yeah. no. You need to do Look the last Star's one. Face you here. need to do the last one. Oh, the shot glasses you see. I just did three shots, minutes. motherfucker. You do He's, one. Uh, so uh, I definitely see their second from uh, He's like, Ooh. side there on the bottom. Uh, Lazarus of course. Long, Manitoba. Just say hello, Laz. And greetings, everybody. How y'all doing today? We've won an award or two along the way here, folks. Great, I think. Uh, great and we were all recognized uh, uh, only now, but, uh, uh, on the same stream here. Hours, uh, we broadcast. had some fun with Lord British. Uh, you, you know, uh, uh, your, your work with the New Britannia News Network, uh, I think it's fantastic. You know, we were, we were sort of there, we were together right as you were uh, kicking it off. Uh, and, uh, uh, you know, I, I've got to say... Uh, I really enjoy both the times I've only caught it uh, by listening, and I also enjoy it when I bumped into you guys in game uh, as well. And I think that it is providing really a fantastic service to the community as well as, uh, frankly, it's just entertaining. So I, I think it's just a, a, a great combination of uh, civic uh, enrichment and uh, and just flat out entertainment. So uh, uh, thank you so much for, uh, uh, for for your work with the NBNN. Enriching uh, the and, uh, and civilization. And in return, we would like to induct you into the Order of New Britannian Empire. Uh, consider yourself, please, a knight of the realm. And of course, now I have the clip this, uh, uh, later on problem. here, you guys. Well, if see. you do recall, uh, during the BMC convention uh, this last year, um, you actually awarded me the medal in person. Yep. And I'm wearing it. I know right, so, for the, but uh, to do it publicly. I was just yeah. correcting yeah. Lord it's British. Very much yeah. appreciated. Thank you very much. What, what, own, what nerve of me uh, correcting Lord British. Good deed, uh, just giving it to you publicly. We love the stuff that we uh, do out there. Uh, we enjoy the community, and uh, we love what you guys are doing, and that's why we do what we do. Where you give me a shout uh, out, and I'll cut off and not even well, notice. It would be the same if you guys weren't uh, pushing it uh, to the levels you guys are. I mean, you'd be. Uh, um, uh, you know, you and, Space and others in your crew, for that matter. Um, okay, so yeah. he right there helps us. Uh, Jack Frost, who is uh, in Hawaii, there in, in Hawaii right now, <laughs> he can't be there, which is either. Um, both the integral members of uh, you know our team, and of course Jack, yeah, not here and, again. Uh, you know, uh, <laughs> and not only yourself, but also Jack. Uh, obviously, love to bump into him in game while you guys do that work as well. Uh, uh, but anyway, thank you yeah, so you'd much. Rather build a and, barn. Uh, uh, thank you for your good work, and glad to recognize you as a knight of the realm. And speaking of Jack, so Jack, you that you wants to donate. Your, uh, I'll just start streaming again. once I can and get a right good camera. Area. Speaking of Jack, look at this guy. I hear you're in Hawaii. Is that why it's so sunny there around you on the screen? Yes, it Rare is. Rare glint. I, I really lock. can't actually see anything on Yeah, it. yeah. I couldn't even find the unmute button. I Gotta love Themo. Themo's ass. You are unmuted, and okay. yes, it's obviously super sunny. I see some palm trees behind you. Fix and up the laptop to show the palm trees in the background. By, uh, yeah. Gotta love them. By the brightness of the sun behind you, which is probably why you can't see the screen. And so, yeah, it, you know, it, oh, that looks like you're suffering <laughs> so badly there. I'm, I am. It's a travesty. Unfortunately, I decided to wear a shirt. That way I didn't, like, frighten anybody. <laughs> uh, well, well, Jack, uh, you know, as you know, um, uh, you know, I, I very much enjoy uh, playing alongside you in-game also. I see you in-game uh, with uh, regularity. Um, you know, we uh, were just talking with Lazarus there about, uh, you know, your, your connection and work with the NBNN. Uh, yeah. But also, uh, specifically for your individual work, even as a streamer, uh, we wanted to say thank you, thank you, thank you. You, know, you're, you're, you kind of uh, play well and support the plays well at others. Wide variety of roles. <laughs> uh, uh, and so we wanted to gets also, an a plus. Uh, induct you into the Order of New Britannia. You Empire, get a gold star. Uh, to say thank you for your great works throughout the community. Uh, throughout, we know support of Indian in, but in particular. Uh, today also as independently as a streamer, uh, and uh, you know, as soon as we get a chance to send you one of these or hand it to you in person, I love this. Uh, we'll oh. so. I'll be back in Austin on Wednesday. Hey Casey, you want to pick me up from the airport? <laughs> I'll be here Wednesday. Yeah, that's if someone picks me up from the airport. Hey Casey, <laughs> oh. can I get a ride for the airport? <laughs> we'll take care of it. Call me. 
Pleasure. And the last is actually uh, not Everybody knows I'm always glad to help, so. Casey Cupcakes. Thank you for coming in. And, uh, and one of the reasons why you see He's him in got, here got to get dressed up. Now, what people don't really know is you dress like this on a regular basis every day, right, Casey? Once every week or two. Yeah, I think people should wear suits or nice shirts all the time. I also believe you should always have a clean handkerchief at any time. Now, about this point, I don't know what happens, but the, the sink gets off. Um, uh, it's not off too much. Uh, if you're, uh, if you're Casey really watching, you'll is, notice it. Yeah, but, uh, well yeah, it, it was what it was. We had problems rendering uh, it. But he individually and uh, a, a, a great many people who live in this region of the country uh, come of here he talks to about your the cupcakes. offices. Uh, to help make the work we do uh, easier and more fun Tasty cakes. and more engaged you know, directly with the community uh, physically, including a lot of the stuff you've seen on the tour, a lot of the holiday stuff. Yeah, uh, and I always try to bring some uh, form of cupcakes, what the actual cupcakes cupcakes uh, exactly. Like, uh, cupcake all vineyard kinds of things around here uh, that you sort of steered in. I know you have to a lot of other people that are coming with you, uh, but uh, uh, but for you in particular, we wanted to down there. invite you into the order of the New Britannian Empire. Uh, of course, that uh, can we'll watch this telethon from, from here on. Um, I, kinda, but, uh, I try to uh, put that thing on. Uh, my fingers aren't working. Uh, 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 for your, the order of the New Britannian Empire, please uh, consider yourself the knight of our realm and have all the uh, you know the uh, the duties and honors and such that that uh, duties uh, and honors. So. Greatly, You've greatly been conscripted. Absolutely. Thank you. Time is when Star was sneaking my chaos medal. He awarded me to my wife. He said duty. Yeah, I was going to put that in. Is that you're in fast forward today? But anyway, moving on. Come on. Yeah. Okay. So on Thursday. On Thursday. Our crew was oh. Bob was working on the Elder Sheep Tree house. Boning. Kevin was still updating <laughs> the male avatar. Leo is doing the same thing with the audio bugs. Bug. That was like three seconds and water wheel. Ooh, a water yeah, wheel poop sound and, and poop farting noises. Poop and farting Sweet. noises, yeah. Was, uh, we we get a what? kick out of jokes. Yeah, they're working oh, on it, man. <laughs> Gotta watch the show. Stay, stay up there. You, I, I you know, into the game. you know these guys yeah, are gonna have a field day with these damn outhouses now. I mean, we oh, had uh, oh. we had what's his name yesterday making all signs of sound. Crafty you know, method. Yeah, crafty method yesterday having a good time in there. Uh, but anyway, moving on. <laughs> Hilarious. I love it. I love it, man. I love these guys. I love this shit. Oh, okay, so let's see then. Uh... <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Here Matt it is. Boning sheep. Boning sheep. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> Pardon me. It's boning sheep. So we yeah. can go back to that sheep fuckers uh, <laughs> skit or joke that we had going on a few weeks ago. Uh, so we oh, we're going to have a field day with this. Oh, shit. Bugs. Reed's working on the road. So there. from here. Yeah, you know, I'm show, showing some of the funnier things, and of course, shortly after this, uh, you aren't there for the what's coming up here, Casey. Um, we got the uh, crafty method coming up. And greetings, everybody. And this scene, this is, Laz. This is Jack. Bursting out of the uh, lunch with Laz and Jack, and today we are going to buy another than Casey Cupcakes. Casey Cupcakes. Yes. How you doing today, guys? Uh -oh. oh no! <laughs> what was he? he? He must have had to get here early. Oh yeah! Now you know it's got to be popular when people are lying in wait, awesome. so that when we start the stream, they can make an entrance. You know, I, I, I did not expect that. One. I love this shit. I love this shit. I'm telling you. Ben. Describe it for those on the radio. Yeah. Is, uh, and of course, okay, Casey. So. Describe it for the people on the radio. Yes, uh, we got to remember that. I think the first time I came on the show, I went into the outhouse as well. Everybody loves the outhouses. And, of course, this is where... Uh, I, I was not expecting this, but uh, this is where I tell the story of how it was born. And, uh, you too. 
Uh, I got my one B. More than deserve uh, to become a knight of New Britannia. I am so honored. Thank you. I yeah. am. Uh, Oh, <laughs> 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 yeah, here we go. For you, maybe I will go right into the camera. Oh, oh. <laughs> hey, make it hurt. Make it hurt. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the first card. Right? Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay. What you do from the, not only your own community, but the community of the town hall. We've been working with you guys. We've been working with you guys. I've been with you all. Um, and I'm going to skip this stuff in the camera here. Then I hijacked the podium. Yeah. Talk, talk about getting up on the soapbox. Now, of course, the audio is a bit out of sync. I appreciate I came in here last December. I missed the Yule hat by three days. I had no clue what was going on. I've been watching Charity Avatar for the longest time. And I said, let me jump in. And one day, I was having a conversation. I was hanging out with everybody. Um, and I was conversing with everybody. Uh, Winfield, you and I, we talk a lot. I talk with Blake. I talk with my guild members. I talk with the community. I love and we had a lot of people at this, this convention. Shit. I got to put that on record for everybody. Uh, one of the first things I said to you was trying to make it, but trying to communicate with Laz and, and, and Jack at the same time to figure out exactly where and when. You know what? I want to be the next Howard Stern of Rowdy Avatar. And that was the dream, you know? And said, why not? <laughs> I, I didn't see this going. I said, we got the video on, we got this, we got that. And we were just tossing around names. And truthfully, to be honest, NBNN was created just as Giggles and Grimms. I was going to do the Adventures of Lazarus Long. Adventures of Lazarus Long, that's right. And Richard Harris <laughs> new production. I said, I'm just going to go around, I'm going to do this. And then all of a sudden, Zeke goes, hold on, hold on. I'm going to do this. NBNN, Nick Return, Nick Network. You're an F and genius. <laughs> and within an hour, NBNN was created. We went live, St. Patrick's Day this year, and in the last nine months, it's been one Since I found out about it, I've been trying to promote it and spread the word from <laughs> the day. Far along, Richard Gary, yeah, at that point, I was just like, really? I just won the 1B? And the rest of the and everybody in the community. Um, I got it. Amber Rain was supposed to Skype with us today. The lovely and mistress of chaos. Miss Amber Rain. We miss you. We love we you. Love we love you, Amber. could have been here. Um, somebody told me nine months ago, Dress. I'd be talking to you guys. I'd be doing this. I'd be talking to Tracy. And we'd be part of this community building this. I said, F you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and that's right. Yeah. Some, somebody told me I was going to be doing this. Nice. And then, of course, that brings us You're listening to up to about present day. Radio Tuesday. Media. And no other better freaking place in the world than now, of course, uh, we, we, we finish up the story actually uh, no with this here on the Wednesday sh uh, show. Laz and Jack. And greetings, everybody. This is Laz. This is Jack. Welcome to Lunch with Laz and Jack. And today we are joined by... Casey Cupcakes. And Scrota. Hey. Yay. <laughs> Yay. How are you? Got it, hey. guys. Got everybody in. It is Tuesday, March 15th, 2016, Shroud the Avatar for the record. How are we doing today, guys? Now, of course, we let, I let this roll um, Great. from here, bringing everybody yeah, to the final date. The and, of course, what uh, happens, uh, Lord British actually shows up on uh, Wednesday. Today. <laughs> I'm sorry, on Tuesday. Sliding into the studio right under the gun that's... Uh, joins us you can make it as always and of course jack and i 
Yeah, he pops a squat down on the lawn. That with that new guy that was hanging around with us yesterday. Oh, uh, this is this is the last one here. Yeah. The EVL's uh, release version of the Hat Quest, where we've got the bucket helm for. We're almost at full quest. capacity in this video. Out. And that was pretty nah, cool. we, we, I could fit um, more. I spoke with the folks over there. And, I, I uh, got more seats in the chest. Phoenix, <laughs> uh, the guys at the Phoenix We'd have Republic to get certified by the their fire department. To step up and run next release's quest. So we're going to be interesting to, interested to see. So uh, they were talking uh, about the hack up, quest that EVL was running. Uh, the fact that Port that Phoenix has stepped up, uh, from the, folks down uh, the folks over there have uh, stepped up to take really up next month's quest and do a player run quest. Uh, new folks and of course, uh, you know, it's just great to see uh, come full circle. Um, yeah, we've, we've tried to work as close uh, with these guys down there, Port Hilary, as possible. Um, we, we've, we've bent a few rules once or twice. Uh, we've got a slap on the wrist here and there. Uh, but for the most part, uh, you know, we, we try and bring you the best of the, you know, what the game's got to offer. Um, and as well, uh, you know, just try and keep it entertaining for everybody. The concept of hospitaliers and outlanders. I'm understanding that the folks down there are really Now, of course, this is going to run. And uh, I don't know if we really want to run the whole, uh, the next, what is it, 15, 20 minutes here? Is it just uh, the rest of Tuesday? It's just the rest of uh, Tuesday's show, correct. Um, but of course, we were covering some really good topic here. What would cause somebody to be driven away? And again, when Lord British talks about the hospitaliers and yes, absolutely. Um, no, I never did see Rustic Dragon uh, on there. What do you mean? This little promo I shot for you guys. <laughs> oh yeah, you know, it's an hour. It's like, you know, the commercials and all that. I want I wanted to put in. Uh, and yeah, what we're gonna do here is uh, let's go ahead and clip this here now. Um, we'll go ahead and uh, yep. start wrapping it up. In this way, we're not talking over talking over. Did you enjoy the present I left you? Oh, you are too funny. Is uh, <laughs> and I sh I should have uh, found a way to. Uh, show that to people but i couldn't because i was boxed in let me uh, just get back to the right screen here i had uh, blocked in yeah, lazarus's chair with stonewall yeah i logged into the game today to uh be trapped in the middle of a stone wall uh, thank you scrota <laughs> but uh my pleasure uh, yeah i wanted to do like all the commercials that briar vesper did um, I wanted to do a whole bunch of uh, just other things, but the video was really growing. Uh, I originally wanted to be a half hour, just a you know, quick, short, sweet. And as I kept doing this, I added that, I added the other thing, I added the next thing. Um, and we were having some fun with it. Um, but that was the year in review, folks. Uh, that was uh, what we've done over the past year, at least some of it. Um, for those of you who've been here along for the ride... Uh, we thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Uh, without you guys, it wouldn't be possible, of course. Um, and it's just been one hell of a ride. Uh, Jack and I, when we finally really put our minds to it, just said, this is what we want to do. Um, and for some people who don't realize, uh, you know, I'm just, you know, I mean, I'm nobody special. I mean, I came out of nowhere. I, I was following Shroud of the Avatar. Um, I saw it when it came out on Kickstarter, and I kick myself in the butt to these days, um, to this day, because uh, literally I could have bought in, and I says, nah, and I really didn't get the gist of what you know Kickstarter was and the perks and the pledges and all that good stuff. Um, so you know, I got the Alienware promotion, and you know, I did all that stuff, but I was watching it, and uh, in December of. Uh, 14 is when I finally jumped in and bought in and uh, the rest of course now is history yeah but uh, in the meantime let's go ahead uh, Scrota why don't you give us a little music uh, give us a little calendar music uh, we do have the weekend wrap up here for today right on. Uh, so we, we will get that covered for today um, again Jack is uh, out doing the barn raising 
And, uh, of course, here he is killing me, my lawn guy. I've told him not to come at this time, for crying out loud. That killing you guys out there? <laughs> it's not so bad. All right. I told him not till after 2 o'clock, for crying out loud. Don't even really hear it, actually. Yeah, I've tried to tweak it out um, so that my gain isn't picking up every little thing. I mean, the phone was used to ring and the dogs bark and, you know, life goes on around us here. Um, you know, I am in a house. I'm not, like, in a real studio. <laughs> right. I've built my studio around, you know, the house. Or, you know, however you want to put it. But meanwhile... Uh, we have uh, the calendar here. The calendar is uh, provided by our good friends over at uh, Avatar Circle. Whoa, that didn't sound good. Uh, this is a Google calendar. Anybody who's got a guild uh, and holds events on a regular basis, get in touch with the good folks over there. Kaz and Phoenix Fire is the admin now. Um, and get yourself added to the Google calendar so you can announce your events out here. And... Uh, we host it here on NBNN for everybody to uh, see what's going on day by day. Uh, we are taking out the uh, media events, of course, as we do every weekend. Uh, we don't want to just announce everything for everybody and every um, DJ that's playing throughout the weekend. Otherwise, we'd be here for a whole hour just doing that by itself. Gotta love this shit. <laughs> so anyway, coming up, 7 p.m., uh, today at the Phoenix Republic PVE Nights, uh, Dungeons, Control Points, and Wilderness Areas. Uh, go join the good folks out at the Phoenix Republic uh, Friday night here. Uh, contact Kaz and Phoenix Fire or Malakis. Go out and do some uh, PVE. Hang out with the folks. Have a good time. If you don't like PVE and PVP is more your speed, uh, go on out to Vengeance Madness. Also happening 7 o'clock. Um, go out to the town of Vengeance and uh, fight till the last man is standing. Uh, 8.30 this evening, Friday Night Astronomy. Get out there with Kerr Drakovich. Uh, check out the uh, astronomy and look at the sky and enjoy the moon, stars, and astronomy with uh, the folks there. Uh, Bow and Blood Good, of course, is your zone point or your teleport point as it is these days. Uh, we got to get people to start updating the calendars, get rid of the zone. Saturday, 9 a.m., Pack Slayer working hours. Go join folks out at Pack Slayer, Pack Slayer and see what's happening out there. They get together every Saturday and Sunday, uh, different times. Uh, it right. What's that? <laughs> I said, say it right. I'm just playing, though. <laughs> oh, that's right. I have to, uh, I asked you to play music, and I forgot it's muted there. It's, uh, because it was raining. There we go. Saturday, March 26th, the Fairfield Coliseum. Uh, yeah. 5.30 at the Flying Saucer, Austin, Texas. Uh, I know, I'm out of, that's Saturday, March 26th. Uh, that's next week. We'll cover that. Uh, again, back to uh, Saturday. 2.30 uh, p.m., Gus Ball Training. Go out to uh, Owl's Head and meet up with uh, the folks out there. And uh, do a little half-hour training before the Gus Ball game. 3 p.m. Oh, I jumped all the way over. I'm sorry. My bad. I don't know I did it. Saturday, 11 a.m., Church of the Dark Star. Go join the folks from Avatar's Radio at Church Dark Star. Um, they do a service every Saturday morning at 11 a.m. 1 p.m. Social event down at Diamond Fields Putt Putt Golf Tourney. Uh, we talked about this when we saw a blurb about that. Uh, these guys are going to be using the Gus Ball to uh, do to simulate a golf ball in the court. They use a rug as a target. Uh, pretty interesting stuff there. Um, I've seen that in development. It's really neat. Uh, yeah, you know, and again, I love this shit. Yeah, you know, it's just great stuff what all, all the community's doing out there. And that's happening out at Diamond Fields. Uh, 3 p.m. Saturday, the Burn League Bear Tavern, folks. Uh, harvest, the construction, harvest, and craft. Uh, go out and join those folks out there. Uh, 3 p.m. on Saturday. 
Also happening, uh, the Bear Tavern Banner Brawl. This is something new. I guess happening at the same time out at the Bear Tavern. It's, uh, what is it? Banner Brawl 2 versus 2. The rules are simple. Get all the banners simultaneously, your team colors. Uh, I guess like a capture the flag. Uh, 6 p.m. Saturday, Port Phoenix Social Nights. Go join the good folks over at Port Phoenix. Uh, contact Kaz and Phoenix Fire for details on that. Go socialize with the folks out over there. Uh, 8 p.m. on Saturday, we got PvP FFA Brackets Tournament. Uh, this is out in Vengeance. Uh, this looks like it's something updated. Uh, we'll have to get some information on this. Uh, this looks like a new update to the calendar. Um, we'll bring you more on that as we get it. Uh, again, Sunday, uh, Pax Layer meeting, 8.30 a.m. Uh, come see what Pax Layer is up to in Novia and uh, all the other town areas. Uh, teleport to Winfield out there. Uh, again, back to Sunday, Gus Ball training, 2.30, Gus Ball at 3 p.m., uh, Gus Ball travels around, so figure out where uh, they're going. Uh, you can uh, hit up either Seamus McGinnis, Sand, or Bambino Ludovate for that. Uh, 4 p.m. EVL, the gauntlet. Uh, go out and, uh, to Unterkempf, if I'm pronouncing that right. Uh, it's also uh, she Seamus McGinnis and Jade. Contact them. Uh, to go ahead and join that event. Uh, 5 p.m. Oh, look at who got Gridiron first and second place. Is, uh, now, oh, is that last uh, first and second place? Yep. I just noticed it. Hey, okay. Uh, BMC Gridiron at 5.30. Arrived promptly for uh, registration at 5 o'clock. Uh, they try and keep that as tight as possible. And Sunday, the evening Pack Slayer meeting for those folks who couldn't make it earlier. Uh, then they do this uh, twice over the weekend so that the folks in different time zones can catch up on it. And, of course, topping off the weekend, 8 p.m., Fishing with Winfield. Uh, go join the folks out there, and uh, they pick a different fishing hole week by week. They go out fishing and tell fish stories and tall tales to each other. And that is the calendar for Shrouded Avatar here this weekend. Alrighty, guys. Well, that's going to be about it for us today. Uh, we're going to go ahead and uh, drop our sponsors in here real quickly. My lawn guy is killing me today, I tell you. It's not one thing, it's another. I'd like to say thanks to Ben out at Relics by Rill, RelicsbyRill.com. Go out there, get all your official licensed Shrouded Avatar swag. Uh, you get your patches, get your t-shirts, get your glassware, get your hats, all sorts of other official Shrouded Avatar swag. Use the promo code NBNN, get 10% off your purchase. I'd like to say thanks to Jacob White, SodaMap.com, for helping everybody with their travel needs here in Shrouded Avatar. Go to sodamap.com if you ever get lost in Shroud and the Avatar. Type in where you want to go, where you're at. The map will show you exactly what you need to see and get you on your way happily. Our friends over at sodacraft.com, sodataming.com. Uh, these guys done all the work for you. So if you got a, any needs for that. Yeah. Thanks, Randy. Cool deal. Yeah, just have giving him a minute to pass there before we kill that. I'd like to say thank you for everybody watching in on Twitch and, and in our stream. Yes, thank you everybody. And of course we can't forget to mention ShroudMarketplace.com. Go out to ShroudMarketplace.com, register for an account out there. Uh, if you got stuff to sell, you're looking for something to buy, you missed it in the store. Go check them out. Uh, of course, 
We'd like to thank you, the viewers, for the past wonderful year here in Shrouded Avatar. Uh, without you guys, it wouldn't be possible. And we do this for the community. We do it because it's fun, and we do it because we can. But we're going to go ahead and get out of here. I'm Les. This is Casey Cupcakes. And this is Scroda. And Jack Sock at the day off. And we are NBN. Stay tuned, NBNN, for more news, sports, entertainment, interviews, crazy wild happening, the lawnmower guy, and anything else we can bring you here in Shroud and the Avatar. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. We'll be back on Monday with more, God willing. Stay tuned, NBNN. We'll see you on Monday. I love this shit, but I don't know if they can. He loves you this too. killing me over here. We can make fun of Jack since he's not here. There you go. Jack is the daddy. You're the father. Mm -hmm.